Hello, my name is Ross Johnson. I'm an autistic savant from Victoria, British Columbia, Canada. Today I want to tell my viewers that I'll be embarking on my 73rd trip on the Via Rail Canadian on February 14th. Me and my support worker, Paul Steer, are traveling together on Via Number 2, the Canadian. Now, Via Rail Canada is Canada's national passenger rail service. I myself being on the autism spectrum, I absolutely am obsessed everything with VRL Canada. That's one of my most favorite autistic obsessions. So um, I have traveled with Via Rail now 72 trips, mainly on the Via Rail Canadian. The Via Rail Canadian travels uh, from Vancouver to Toronto twice per week leaving on Tuesdays and Fridays in the off-peak season, which is October 15th to April 28th, and then the high season April 30th to October 13th of the summer year, in which it travels on Sundays also from Vancouver, Thursdays from Toronto. The trip takes four and a half days, and it's 4,466 kilometers each way. Now, my... Uh, trips I have done are mainly in Alberta and British Columbia. I've taken the train mostly westbound, Jasper to Vancouver, Canvas to Vancouver, Saskatoon to Vancouver, mainly those segments. I have taken it eastbound also, which is Vancouver to Jasper, Vancouver to Rivers, Manitoba, as far as I've gone across Canada. Uh, but I wanted to tell um, everyone that I'll be taking my 73rd, 74th, and 75th trip coming this February. I'm leaving on Via Number 2, the Canadian, from Vancouver to Toronto on February 14th. That's a Tuesday in this year. I'm taking, as I said, sleeper class. Um, and it includes all my meals and access to the total train. But my train isn't very long, given it's off-peak season. I will have two engines, a baggage car, a, a coach car, a Skyline Dome car, a three manor sleeper cars, and a dining car, and then the Chateau Prestige and the Park Prestige. Um, we are in car 212, which is the third sleeper car from the head end. And we have all of our meals included, and we'll be on the train from February 14th to the 15th to the 16th to the 17th to arrive in Toronto on the 18th at 9.30 a.m., given the train's on time. I'm also very excited because I've never been to Toronto before. So, and Toronto is a huge um, hub for the VRL Canada uh, trains. Um, I was able to book a extension trip on the Saturday the 18th um, from Toronto to Brockville on back in the business class. I've never been on the corridor services before. So, for who, those of you who do not know of Via Rail Canada or are not familiar with Via Rail Canada, their website is www.viarail.ca. That's www.viarail.ca. And um, that's the Canada's National Passenger Rail Service, Le um, much like Amtrak is in the U.S. Um, if you ever ever get a chance to take the Via Rail Canadian, it is a trip of a lifetime. A lot of people come from around the world to ride on Via Rail's Canadian. Via, the, Via, the Via Rail Canadian is a flagship train. It's, it's, it's the flagship train of Via Rail Canada's entire 12,500 kilometer network. Um, so yeah, I'll be taking my 73rd trip on February 14th. We leave Vancouver at 8.30 p.m. and we stop at, well, we don't, have, we don't necessarily stop at, but we do stop at for Kamloops, Jasper, Edmonton, Saskatoon, Winnipeg, and then they do a full crew change and they carry on to Sioux Lookout and then on to Toronto. So I'm very obsessed with riding the train and remembering all the trips I've done. I like um, memorizing the types of cars they're on, um, the locomotive power, um, where they change crews, where the engine men change crews, uh, horsepower, the locomotives, and the schedules and fares before and after tax. Um, so I'll, when I get home from my trip, I'll be posting my pictures and my video, if I get any video, on my Facebook page, which is Via Rail and Rocky Mountaineer Rail Travel. That's on Facebook. 
the Bia Rail and Rocky Mountaineer Rail Travel. Hope to see you on Facebook. And please like my video and subscribe. Talk to you again.